And the great thing about trying to get things right, if you're trying to describe the world governed by institutions, by biology, by the laws of physics even, is that you can also get things wrong. And one of the interesting aspects of my writing life has to, been to receive letters from readers saying, here's one. I get a letter, a very polite letter from a lady, and she says, I've just read your novel, it's called The Comfort of Strangers. She said, I know it was published 28 years ago, and I'm sure many people have pointed out to you uh, a very important error you made. So, my four characters go out on a balcony. They're in Venice. It's July. It's a beautiful night. The night sky is particularly vivid. Uh, and they look up and they see Orion hanging over the sky with his dog at his feet and his sword, the most beautiful constellation, I think, in the world. She said, you cannot see Orion in July in the Northern Hemisphere. <laughs> if you want it to be July and uh, you want to see Orion, then you better go to New Zealand or Porto Alegre, <laughs> she might have said. And then she added, since your novel is so sinister, why don't you have Scorpio, which you could see, which was a very good suggestion. Then she said, I'm 87 years old. I live on a little island in the English Channel, and I spend much of my time on the summer nights in a hammock gazing at the stars. And I wish you well with your writing enterprises. Now, I had no choice but in the next edition of that book to, to change it. 